cheers. hotel room we are literally just hours away from me hopping on a plane and fucking flying away to I'm not gonna lie before I got here I was definitely way 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 more confident I was thinking I got this it's super easy I'm moving to Japan I'm bold Ellis it's gonna be just a simple move. It's not gonna be any different from when I moved from college. And then we get here and it hits me like a ton of fucking bricks. I realize the weight of what I'm doing. I'm moving across the fucking world, away from all my friends and people that I know, being either a short drive away or a short flight away. Um, my Japanese is bad, is poor, at least I know some, but definitely not enough to live with. And it, I think I was overwhelmed with all the things that I was realizing and feeling. And I think I just wanted to say that it was not just fun and games for me, like, ooh, I'm moving to Japan. I know in my last video too, I was like, oh yeah, I'm moving to Japan, I really wanted to, and now it's happening, and that's it. Um, now I'm realizing that it's not just so easy to like say, hey, I'm, I wanna do something, I'm gonna do something, and then you get to right to the edge, and you're like, fuck, that's scary. Um, I think Definitely, definitely, definitely yesterday, the only thing that was giving me peace was bitch, you're bold, Ellis, and you have to lean into your discomfort. It is so fucking uncomfortable right now how overwhelmed I am, but I have to lean into my discomfort. That's the only way that I'm going to grow with this, and the only way that this entire trip, entire job, entire move is going to be worth it for my entire life. I have to realize that this big life shift and change is what is going to be the most satisfying growth later on, even though it is so fucking scary right now. And also, God bless that I'm finally alone right now. I will tell him to myself. I'm finally alone. I finally can just sit down and film, record, whatever the fuck without someone listening to me or whatever. I don't care if they're listening out there, outside my hotel room or in the notes rooms or whatever. That's another thing. That's another thing. Filming makes me uncomfortable. Filming doesn't make me uncomfortable. Filming with other people listening or watching or judging makes me uncomfortable. And I definitely have to work and improve on that because I know I can be good at this. I'm gonna put that into existence. I know I can be good at this. I know I can try really hard. I know that I will put in the effort to research and do my best. It's just gonna be a process. It, that's what it is. It's gonna be awkward, uncomfortable, weird to watch for a while. And, and that's where I wanna say, because these videos are for my friends, and family, watching my life abroad, or um, just getting getting a little taste of what I'm doing and who I am from far away, it brings me a lot of comfort because I know y'all will stick with me through it. Um, because 
I want the expectations to be set like not that Ellis is a YouTuber, none of that. I want the expectations to be set that, hey, Ellis is making casual videos for us to see what she's up to in an organized fashion and not that I'm a YouTuber. And I think that will make it less cringy for y'all to watch me and make it less cringy for me making it because literally I'm going to treat the camera like this is so dumb. I don't like when YouTubers are like, I love you guys over there and everything. For me, my phone right now, or my camera, or whatever the fuck, is my portal to you guys. My friends, my actual friends. And I think that will help too, just treating it like I'm talking to a friend. Like even right now, no one's here, and I'm just talking to... And I feel so much more comfortable definitely um so yeah in this video i really just want to say that i'm moving and this is just gonna be footage of all that and i want you to know whatever it looks like i'm a virgo ass bitch and i can play whatever role sort of like a gemini you know what i mean um but even though it looks happy and fun and exciting, just know that yesterday I was crying like this. And I had to get tears because uh, girl was not coping. Girl was not coping. So yeah, I will see you later. We're going to hop on a plane right now and let's have the most fun we can possible. Even though I feel like breaking down. <laughs>